Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Tuesday the 21st of March 2023. I hope you are keeping well. Uh, dusk is come upon us here in Bangkok. It's just about getting dark uh, early evening, but the air conditioning is still running because it's still very hot uh, in what is essentially our just about to become summertime, what we call summer here in Thailand. Although we don't really have a winter, I'm sure you'll understand. One reason why I'm constantly on a Trump and Trump supporters, um, even though I'm not American, uh, is because I know that nonsense spreads. And especially in the, the times of the internet, we can see how idiocy and disinformation and misinformation and lies just spread across the whole globe very quickly. And that's why we need to keep criticizing and calling out nonsense. Uh, I see in the UK, uh, they're trying to follow Trump's playbook. Um, we uh, people, Everybody in the UK saw that Boris Johnson lied. Clearly, he was misleading Parliament. He clearly lied. There is nothing, no one who actually is a re rational human being can believe anything else. And yet his supporters and right-wing allies in the newspapers, the newspapers have always been controlled by right-wing uh by right wingers in the UK, with a couple of exceptions, um, just just forever, basically. And um, and anyway, they're calling uh, the Johnson inquiry a witch hunt. Oh yeah, where have we heard that before? Yes, indeed, the uh, orange globule. Um, so it's and and you know they're just uh, saying oh it's unfair a kangaroo call all of this kind of stuff all of this nonsense absolute rubbish and this kind of thing wouldn't would wouldn't have been acceptable in the UK a short time ago so let's say before Trump even and uh, but you know these ideas get exported this nonsense gets around and around and that's the reason why it's so important for people who are not in America to call out Trump's nonsense and Trump's allies nonsense. Right, okay, let's get on with the game of Sudoku. Uh, again, I shall mention that this is not likely to be a uh, notation-free game because that's not usually the way that I play Sudoku. Let's get on with the game anyway. This is the LA Times Expert Level game, the third in my daily trio, or normally a daily trio of games anyway that I like to play on this channel. If you're new to the channel, welcome And presumably you know how to play the game of Sudoku already. Let's have a quick look. Aha, one and three, blocking across these rows, so we get ourselves a pair of one and three here. What does it mean? The fours can go anywhere. The sevens, there we go, seven blocking down here and down here, so that means the seven has to be there. And we will be left here with a pair of four and eight. Oh, hang on a second, look, three, I've just noticed, look, we get a three in this square, we got three down here, and three up here, and that's a three there, and then I just was think, looking at that, because I looked at the eights across here, and saw that the eights blocked here, and blocked here, and that caused me to look up here, and notice the three, and now I see that the eight must be in that square there, so we'll be left here with a four and a five, the fours being somewhere along there, and the fives not revealing too much at the moment uh this was four and so this can't be four then so this has to be our four and the last number for this column is two right so twos are in those squares Uh, 
Okay, four blocking down here, or four across here, puts four into one of these two squares, blocking up that way. That gives me a four there. Eight up here, up here, and across there. That puts an eight into that square. Who's up there? Four, six, seven. Four blocking these squares and four down here, so that puts a four into that square there. And indeed, two blocking these squares, so two over here. What do we need? Six, eight. So we got the six blocking down here. There's the six. That will be our eight. Okay, we've got eight up here and eight across here like this. So we got ourselves a pair of two and eight in those squares there. What does it mean? Two and eight. So we are also looking for fours. We got a blocking four across there. So fours in those squares. And seven across. So that's a pair of four, seven. That's two, eight. And this will be nine. Okay, we've got nine across here, nine across here, and nine up here. That gives me a nine in that square there. Nine up here, nine up there, and nine across there. Puts a nine into that square. Nine across here, across here, up there. Uh, I think we've got one more to go, or maybe two more. Nines down here. Nope, it's not the end yet. We've got nines here and we've got nine blocking down here. This must be the last one. Yes, it was. Okay, missing digits here and here look to be five and seven. Okay. Okay, we've got one blocking up here now and one across here. That puts a one into that square. Um, 
don't know what it means, but the seven blocking across here definitely puts seven into those squares. We had two in those squares, these squares, didn't we? Two, seven. What else do we need? Five, six. So this is five, six. Ah, <laughs> sevens across here. Actually, I, I didn't even see this. Just didn't see it. That's how my eyes are. Quite poor. Right, so let's have a look and see what we're lacking over here. We are looking for two, and immediately we have... No, we're not. <laughs> We've got... Good grief, my eyes are really bad today. Five, six, eight, I should say, I believe. Five, six, eight. Let's just check. Five, six. And we don't have any intersecting eights, do we? Five, six, and eight are here. We have ones like this. We don't know about the twos just yet, do we? Don't think so. Oh, well, they're there, but. Four. Mm -mm. Threes. Is this five, five, six, eight, all right? One, three, two. Oh, four is one of our missing numbers here. Four across here. Okay, I got you now. Four blocks like this. Okay, four is one of our missing numbers here, blocking across here and here. So this is four, and then we've got threes like that. So this is a pair of four and three. Right, okay, gotcha, four and three, and now this was five, six, eight, so two blocks up here, and that will be the two, and this will be the one. One blocking down here and one across here, puts one into one of these two squares across there, and the one down gives me a one like so. Two blocks up here, it's in one of these squares here, blocking here, two blocking across there, there is our two. Five is one of our missing numbers here, that means that this can't be five, this has to be five, and this will be six, I believe six, yes, six. Six blocking across here, there's our six, the missing number here is a seven. Seven blocking across here puts the seven into that square. The last number to place here is a five, I think. So five blocking up here. There's our five. The missing number here is four. Four blocking down here, putting a four into that square. Three blocks this square and three blocks this square. So in this row, that will be our three. Six blocks this square, so that will be six. And this will finish with a seven. Seven across here and up here gives us the final digit seven there. Uh, missing numbers here are three. And we have a three blocking across there. And... Uh, five, I think. Yes, five goes there. So that also is a five, of course. 
and we have five blocking up here and across there so that will be our five five blocking up across here and up here there is the final digit five here we are only looking for a two uh, where else do we need a two over here two blocking across there there's the final two the missing number here is an eight I think we'll leave eights for the moment. Let's see what else we need. Let's come back to the ones. Can we, can we, can we? Yes, we've got one blocking across here. So here's our one. I know this was one at the bottom here, one and three, wasn't it? I remember one goes there, three goes there. Three blocks up here, up here, and across there. So there's our three. That was indeed the last one. The missing digit here is um, four. Four blocks to the bottom that gives a four here four up there four down here there's our four the last number for this column eight i think all right and the missing number here is six so six blocking down there going here we're looking for eight in this square and that square to finish so that's our los angeles times expert level game not too tricky today that's it thank you very much bye bye see you another time